and we are back again on our little fairy house. Um, I'm starting the steps and I thought go ahead and, and, um, and show you how I'm doing this. Actually, very simple. I have a box of graham crackers and uh, I'm using this small, the, this side in here, okay? For my, for my, uh, for my stairs. And uh, let me cut this off. <clears throat> Excuse me. And I'll show you a couple of things I did. Not much yet, okay? But the stairs needs to go on, so I'll know where I am. And of course, you're gonna go ahead and cut the steps on the end, okay? And let me quickly, 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 make me a pattern here and just cut me one, okay? So I can use, because I know I'm gonna be using it probably. It may take me most of the box, actually because okay there we go so I can have it out of the way so what I did is <clears throat> I started with the rising right here this little bit in here you know would you go step up and that's about a quarter of an inch maybe three eighths around there okay give or take and then the the step is about three quarters of an inch so what I did is okay right here So what I did is, I went in here and did, um, let me show you real quick, because I want to make sure you get all this. Uh, I'm eyeballing everything, so, but if you want to do it, you know, um, with your scoreboard or whatever, then you can, okay? Um, just, I tell you, but I have a nice scoreboard with everything, but by the time I get it here and everything, my handy dandy little, um, knife is it's great let me show you i went to walmart the other day and i got me another set of it because i go through uh, and i and not because i uh, they're going bad because i lose them 88 cents you get four of them you cannot beat that okay and they're very very sharp to begin with be careful but it just scores it does you know cuts as you know as you see me do all kinds of things anyway i came over here and i bought it uh, a fourth of an inch and i went straight down on one side I turn it around and then I fold it, okay? So I have a guidance. Then I come back from the fold about, you know, um, three quarters of an inch. And I'll sock a score a couple of times really good, okay? And bring it this way and now I got my rising and my step. Now I'll go back on this other side, if you wanna say the color side, and come back again in another fourth of an inch. <clears throat> And it's, uh, I, I watched this from a lady and I will put the, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, I will put the, um, you know, her side in, uh, on one of these videos so you can tell, but maybe on this one with the steps. Mm, this is how she does them. And I don't remember the lady, but, uh, uh, you know, but I will put her side there. I think I'm, I subscribed to her, so I should have it. And uh, anyway, so the arrow goes, rise, step, rise. Now another, and then I go back to the cardboard side, another three quarters of an inch. You know, whatever you wanna do. I mean, it depends on you too, the size and everything you're gonna do. It could be bigger, it could be smaller, you know? And again, do it that way, see? And now here's the little steps. Can you tell? There we go, okay? And again, you're gonna go back on this side and do a quarter of an inch. And here's the rising, and then of course another <clears throat> three quarters of an inch, give or take. It don't have to be perfect, you know. It could have been. This is probably was made with uh, either s some kind of bark or stones or whatever, depending. Probably some kind of wood, you know. And so here we go. Okay, here we go. The little stairs. So we got the the rise and the step, the rise and the step, the rise and the step. Okay, now. So that's what I did now I did this in here I got one two three four one two three four steps and I finished with a quarter of an inch up because you're gonna turn it and it's okay because see when you do that as you turn it it will be a little bit wider in here which is okay 
and you know, as you go around on the corner. And this is why I wanted to do it around the corner because uh, the, the corner could be rounder, it could be not, but you know, I wanted to show you how to do this. So now, because I, I did this, the, the horizon, so this little horizon is gonna go right into it, okay, and I'm gonna glue that in there. <clears throat> Can do a few steps at a time and then glue them on like this see okay and then now very careful on the rising and in this and in the step you want to make sure they look it's just normal I guess like you were going in there see okay there we go there we go Make sure you hold it until it's good and glued. And then I'm gonna go back on this rising and bring it in, and of course on the step, on the side of it, you know. And again, you go back this way, okay? Okay, whoops. There we go. Yeah, we got it. I'll, I'll glue this one back on down here. Okay. Right. What I'll probably do is bring this out a little bit, see? And then just glue it in there. No biggie. Make sure this rising is right straight on, on a flat surface. This here is going to be put on a, another board or something, you know, when I get done with the whole thing. Of course, make it like a really pretty little scene and stuff, okay? Alrighty, see? And then just keep going. And there again, there's your riser right here. And I'm just gonna keep on going. Bring out the foil. This is why you need to do this before you paint it or anything, in case you need to bring the foil out a little bit some in some areas. Just make sure you don't break it. Okay, here we go, see? So now I'm gonna come back in here and just do it like that, okay? Let's see if I can get it. Oh, I think, oh. See, it just keeps on going up, and I, I think it's so cool doing it this way. And you don't wanna do it all in one piece, just do it little pieces at a time, like three or four little steps at a time, okay? And, and that way, you really are so much better off. I'm gonna go ahead and glue this little rising in there. Come on, baby. So as, as I think about it, I get y'all, you, you know, and do stuff. It really is better to do, like I said, the, the steps before you paint it. Uh, <coughs> excuse me. I'm hoping I can finish it this, week, this weekend so y'all, I can put it out there Monday. I start putting my videos out there Monday, okay? Uh, I got kids to do but I can do both Kids, you know uh, it takes a little bit but I think this one is not gonna take that long it's a beautiful beautiful little kit um, I uh, may send it to me the uh, the banner oh my god it's so cute um, so you know nice thing about it you can put it over a window on your fireplace the the, the stockings is not so humongous that you know uh, so it, it'd be beautiful over a window for Christmas over your uh, you know your drapes Oh my god, it would look awesome. Okay. See how that goes The little steps. Oh, I'm so excited about this Okay, well, we're gonna do some uh, we're gonna do a little bit more. Okay. I don't want to keep you just do a little bit and then just stop So okay, so I'm gonna do another bit of a rice and to glue it into this one here. Okay and then step and so on and so on, okay? That's a good way to do it. Just rise and step, rise and step, and finish with rising, okay? I hope I pronounced that right, but you know what I'm talking about. And 
and here we go okay and now I'll go back here and since I folded I can tell where I am like I said if you have one of those uh, scoreboards like a, a quarter maybe to be about a quarter and three quarters quarter and three quarters remember the little boogers have small they're tiny okay they have little steps <laughs> okay here we go again and then again the rising And this is a good way to utilize your boxes that you uh, have, cookies, cereal, whatever, okay? And, uh, and it starts saving your foils now. I mean, you know, some of them can be washed real quick, you know, have a little bleach water, soapy water, bring some out really good, let it dry, and when you get them all, you get it ready to go. That's what recycle comes about, really. I did not do it that way because I don't cook anymore and I just happen to have a few because of my bacon and uh, otherwise I probably would have not had any but the rest of it as you can tell I use my uh, I buy this at Sam and uh, but you can go to Dollar Tree and get them for a dollar uh, each one of them like I said cheap is fine probably better okay let's see how we're doing here see how we going we're going to going <laughs> I'm so excited about this. Oh, I tell you, I don't see how people can be sad or upset or whatever because you know, they need, they need to do some good for crafting, don't you think? I think so. I have a lot of good, honestly, I probably, nobody knows. Well, nobody knows why, but I have probably one of the ladies that has more stuff to be upset about but you know what the good lord is with me he loves me he embraces me every day and every day is a joy so you know and, and doing something like this is even more so so that's how i feel about it and thank god the lord gave me the talent to do these things because uh, i think i would have been lost if i didn't have something wonderful to do and fun you know so yeah okay there's one two i'm gonna do another no i'm gonna do this. okay i'm gonna cut this one off right on the horizon is you you really do like i said a few at a time you can control it a little bit better too and again see rising of the horizon okay come on baby Turn it a little bit at a time, and again, I want to make sure that this thing is right in there. So I'm gonna do this, this, and this. Okay, turn it around so that I can see what I'm doing. Because you wanna do it, in other words, you wanna have those up and down as they should go, and the step as they should go. But see how nice it's going up, and I'm going up. I'm going up, yes. So, okay, come on, baby. Get it glue in there. But see, this way I can grab my little thing here and say, get in there and glue. Whoops. Okay, and now we got it. And that is what is so cool about it you know and then as you then later you're gonna come back a little bit you know and try to get it a little closer in here but you know not very much but you'll be able to you know close it up a little bit and so on we're gonna put some uh, make-believe uh, <clears throat> posts out of branches and stuff like that okay alrighty and here we go again worry about some of the glue because really and truly you know let's see here actually I need to go up a little bit more yeah you need to go with the flow as they say
this is why you kind of have to, you know, face it to yourself to so make sure you're doing, you know, it's going fine. Some of the uh, areas are not even, so go ahead and put a little bit of a glue between it. And then that way it'll stay, okay? As I said, this is going to be a true three-dimensional. It's going to go all the way around it. All the uh, the place, in other words, just a full little area house, I guess you could say. All right, let's try to get this little baby over here somehow so that I can. What amazes me when I do this, you know, I, I make these things and then I look at them, especially like this, and I, it's hard to imagine whenever they're done how cute they turn out, you know. Right now it looks like a ball of mess, but it's it's amazing. And, you know, because um, I never do two alike. Uh, I never do two alike of anything, if I can help it. I hate repetition. Uh, it could be in the same theme, but totally different, you know, and uh, that is okay, but not... You know, uh, it's like the dollhouse, uh, and we will be working on the dollhouse too, by the way. <clears throat> and um, when I have done with that one, I'll if I do another one, it'll be totally different. You know, uh, it could be more elaborate. It could be, I don't know. You know, I haven't decided yet what, but it'll be something. Okay, I got it in there. So here we go. We go again. Uh, and here we go. <coughs> mm. Hate this cuff. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and cut this one again the same size because I wanna keep them all the same size, okay? Oops, that must be. Okay. I thought I was gonna do shabby chic on this, you know, it's, I don't think so. I don't, maybe not, maybe when I do some of the little things that go inside, but uh, I, I don't know what I was thinking, really. It's very hard to do that in here. You know, it really, really is. <coughs> okay, we're gonna keep on going. Again, I'm gonna start in the rice, and I'm just gonna keep on going till I go up. I want you to see it all the way up. And if you get bored, fast forward. There we go. So you do back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, okay? I say be careful, you don't, you don't wanna cut it, but you do wanna fold it. The folds nice, okay? And if they're not exactly the same, you see, it's okay because they're supposed to be exactly the same. This little book, this little fairies are doing things out of nature. Nature is not perfect. I can tell you that right now. <clears throat> I'm gonna go ahead and do a few more this time. Let's see how far I get up. I can always cut it if I feel like it's awkward, okay? Okay. But see how much faster this goes if you're gonna get the, the bore out and this, that, and the other. I was in Mexico uh, a lot of years ago and I went to Tasco, a beautiful, beautiful city in Mexico. It's made up, uh, it has a lot of Spanish influence. White building with uh, those ceramic tiles, you know, those beautiful red tiles. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, let's see what I'm doing right here. Yeah, I think I can finish this off. 
Anyway, there was a designer there that he actually designed. It's a silver mine, in Tosco. And uh, this is why we went. Uh, a cousin of my, the wife of a cousin of my uh, husband was going to sell some silver and she wanted me to go with her so that I can translate. Anyway, uh, there's this man in there named Mateo. And uh, he was designing and he even showed me, he was so, he was so cute. He even showed me the invoices to let me know that they were true, you know, from, uh, uh, what is it? Uh, oh my God, I can remember now. It's no Macy's. It's one of those big, uh, you know, expensive things. Anyway, and um, she, uh, he, uh, his little um, studio, I guess you call it, it was so humble. And a lot of the materials, a lot of the stuff, you know, equipment that he used, was just simple equipment, you know, and it, 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 and it just, I just loved it. I just loved it. His hands, uh, they were beautiful as far as I'm concerned. I think any crafter's hands that they, you can tell the, the wear of them and the, how, you know, how much they done with them, you know, and, and it was just such a wonderful experience for me. Uh, okay, one more little riser and then we'll just, let's see. And the reason I'm saying that is because I know we buy a lot of stuff. Hey, I'm guilty, okay? But somehow or other, I'll come back to these simple things to do that it works for me better than say the things that they sell, okay? So just because you don't have it, it does not mean that you cannot do it. <laughs> that's what I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> you may don't want to hear it, but that's what I'm telling you. <clears throat> okay, so let's see what I'm oh, right here. So let's go back to our little rising. And we're gonna do that. Oh my goodness. My goodness. All right. Let's see if I can get some more of this out. I really do need to get it out, otherwise, it's not gonna glue into it. Okay. You just work with it, you know? But it's so pretty going up in it. See, once you get it already, you can kind of push it in if you need to a little bit, okay? But while you're trying to get it glued, try to pull, you know, the, the foil to you, you know, and uh, just be careful with it, but, you know, you can do it. Okay, see, like I just done in here. Because I do want to glue it, glue it, glue it, <laughs> glue it into place. See? If you want the rice and taller, you can, you know, but I, I didn't want to. Okay, and I'm coming back in here, see? I could stay here. I'm not going to mow today. Like I said, I think I have a sinus infection, and uh, I'll do a mow a few days ago. It went. It's just. And I had a mask. I always wear a mask. I wear a mask. I put the goggles. Uh, I mean, I look like something from outer space. But that's the only way I could do it. 
But even that, even that, uh, I, you know, it just gets me. So today I'm not mowing the whole, <coughs> the whole week and all long. And uh, it's just not going to happen. Okay, let's see if I can get that just right. There we go. Okay, what I'm going to do now, <coughs> which also is something you need to learn and do, I'm going to do a platform, okay? Because otherwise it's going to go this direction and I don't want to. So what I'm going to do once I get this here done, right here, which is about right. There we go. I'm going to cut this here. that would be too much for me okay and then we're going to do a like I say a um, a platform And by the way, this glue is one show. Once you paint it, everything, it's just part of it. Uh, we're gonna be having some moss and stuff like that also here and there. So whatever you find somewhere they are, I don't know what to do with it, just, just stick a piece of moss. Okay, see, I got it in there. Okay, so far. Alrighty, so what I'm gonna do is, I am gonna do a rising, but then I'm gonna do a platform, like so. And then we're gonna go up this way, okay? Alrighty, and I'm gonna just do it like, well, let me see, hold on, let me, let me make sure that I get this here cut first, okay? <clears throat> so almost a box it took. It may take you more on the next one, it may take you less. Depending how tall you do your building or where you're wrapping around on, okay? There we go. And I'm just gonna do it right here. It may not be quite square, maybe a little bit more. Uh, well, actually, since I have to cut the, uh, I mean, I score the uh, rice in first, and I can do a little bit of it, you know, just enough to glue it on. Okay, like this, and this is going to be my my rice right there, okay? And then we're gonna start the steps going up this way, okay? I'm glad I did this, because then you wouldn't know what I'm doing. So sometimes you do have to wait for the video to watch it, because you may miss something. I don't want y'all to miss anything, right? <laughs> okay, so now I'm gonna do it, it's just kinda Make sure it's nice and straight, every direction. And here we go. And I think we got it. Okay, so I think I can do the other ones going up pretty easy. But if not, you know exactly what, I, what you need to do, right? I'm not 
sure when I started doing stuff, um, my mom had this beautiful watch. I mean, I always been curious how things are, you know, put together. I was little, but I was very curious how that watch worked. And uh, I took it all apart. And I thought I was very smart. I was gonna be able to put it all together. But I had some pieces missing, you know, that, that was, I had some le pieces that, that, I, that I had left. <laughs> and I panic. I panic. But luckily there was a, um, uh, a jeweler downstairs from where we live. And, uh, you know, just the good old craftsman jewelers, you know, that did all kinds of things. Anyway, so I took it to him. I was just overly upset and crying, so you gotta fix this for me. My mom is gonna kill me. <laughs> Excuse me. Anyway, I, um, I was able to fix it. I mean, he did it and I put it back and even mama, mama never found out. And, well, she knows now, but she didn't find out then. And this is where I started, I was just always curious on how things are put together, how you, you know, I mean, and I guess maybe this one is started when I was little. I always wanted to, um, I was more like a loner. Uh, I was very shy, if you can believe that. And then I, uh, and I enjoy doing things on my own, you know. My, my grandmother could uh, cut my little doll's clothes and I'll be sitting somewhere by myself just, you know, sewing and having a wonderful time. And so maybe that's where it came from. Okay, here we go. So now what I'm going to do, again, we're going to do the same, but this one is going to go from here to here. <coughs> Excuse me. So let me go ahead and do the, the bot, the bottom one first. Ooh, got a tickle in my throat. Maybe that help. Okay, so I'm gonna put that right there. Because I do want my rising to go this way, okay? We may don't need very many steps, but I just wanna be sure. And then I'm going to put the other rising on the back of it because I'm gonna be able to glue into it. See? And put this up and that right there. Okay, right like so. Actually, I'm gonna turn this in. See, now it's when I need to turn it in. <laughs> okay, here we go. All right. And I still kind of move it a little bit that direction, okay? Which is okay. So yeah, this is gonna work really well. All right. So for this one, it's gonna go, since it's going straight into it, we're just gonna go ahead and do it like so. Whoops. Well, I'll glue this one just a second. Okay, now we do it again, this one here. I didn't wait until it was dry, see? Let me do that over there. Oh, come on, baby, stay there. Okay. Got it in there. <clears throat> Let's see. And now this one, I want it to come down a little bit more, see? because otherwise it's gonna look like somebody's going to, uh... there we go. I need to bring this 
even if I break it a little bit, just so it will have my little step what I want it. See? Okay, there we go. I think I got it. Okay. And actually, let's see fun but I might have to do this here like this okay let's see if I can get it okay there we got it bring it in here and in here and I think whenever it's you know it's hard to tell but once we get it and you know in the uh, fix up in other words you'll be able to tell more the details okay so uh again i want to bring this so i'm gluing the fold where the rising is okay that's what i'm doing see right there and then of course i know the little rising and then just run right onto it so this one i will just glue this piece in here see let the rising and then just there okay and once we have everything like the you know see when you bring it up everything is just fine uh once we have the you know the branches and everything that hold this um stairs uh everything is going to be fine so here we go see all the way around it make sure you get all the strings especially before you paint it believe me you'll know they're there and then <clears throat> Again, I'm gonna to try to get this out a little bit more because, okay, here we go. Here we go. And I'm gonna glue this in here really good. on the flat surface when you do it okay and it'll be fine and just hold it there until it's good and dry here's my little steps aren't they cute <laughs> so they can go up to their home this is uh, I had an uh, a piece of foil I made an arch because this is gonna be the door entry to the Hold on, I'll show you here. Just let me hold this a little bit longer. Uh, the door entry to their, you know, from the back, of course. And um, they'll be able to get in there. And of course, this will be fixed later and you won't be able to tell nothing. Uh, everything's gonna look really good. And the only thing I may do, I may cut this piece in here and just glue the rising in there. And then the very top will make it look just like a big old stone, okay? Which is all right, too. <clears throat> well, I think I got it in there. Anyway, this is what I did, see? And I did it right at the edge of it because I want to make sure that, you know, the door, because you come in here to the door. And then, of course, this is going to be all covered up. We will do another video on this one, okay? But I wanted to show you the stairs uh, on this one, and I think it looks fantastic. I'm really 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 happy with it and the reason i want to do a video uh later is because i want to make sure the inside of here is painted like i want to it do everything inside here that i need to before i actually do anything else okay because if i don't what's going to happen is it's uh it's going to you know it's going to show um a lot of the uh stuff and it's going to be very hard to do it from this side so this side has a wider angle and you can really get to it with no problem. All right, so I'll see you next time.